Hi everybody, how are you? It's little Emily and um, I'm going to share um, some books, not books, some, it's going to be a short video, but I want to say happy 20 subscribers and thank you for our last video. I did, I think yesterday I labeled it um, Little Space Talk, ha, ah, remember. And again, if anyone followed our old channel, 12 Little Princess, please, all 675 happy subscribers, come on back. You know you want to. We all love you. Yay. Friends and families, daddy dom, mommy dom, caregivers, brothers, sisters, littles, middles, caregivers, and babies, all come back. We all love you. We all miss you. And if you recognize my voice or my face, 12 Little Princess was our old channel. This is a new one. We're starting over because people are really mean and not nice. And yeah. So we're going to show you our little space book bags that we like to bring on adventures when we are fronting or when we are um, age regression. Big words right now. You can't think. Uh, yeah. So, I will show you some little space book bags, and, um, I think we want to do a video. We talked a little bit when I was on Little Space Talk. We talked about mental health, depression, anorexia, bipolar, schizophrenia, maybe not those, but personality disorder, uh, quiet personality disorder, no symptoms of personality disorder. You can have DID, dissociate identity disorder. And be quiet about it. I have some symptoms without having the um, dissociation part. Yeah, but here's my one little puppet. I got this at Target. It's really old. I washed it. It's a little pony or a unicorn. Super cute. Super baby. I like this one. It's super like adorable, and it matches my glasses. And I got these at the dollar store. And they're actually for, obviously, a younger girl, but they fit my face and they don't look small or anything on me. Usually the lenses, because they're hard to look smaller, but they actually fit my face. I don't really have a big face. I'm lucky. I'm fat, but I don't have a big face. And then they can go up like that. <clears throat> I even have them in R.E.D. R.E.D. These remind me of the 1997 Lolita movie with Humbert Humper, which has nothing to do with the Japanese kawaii, 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 kawaii fashion with the Lolita dresses that I do love. Actually, I had one dress in there that's a Lolita dress. Um, it was on my last channel, and I'll have to show everything all over again. But these are, remind me of the uh, Lolita 1997 movie with Humbert Humper, which I think is a great movie. And if you have daddy issues, that movie will definitely make me trigger. A tie-dye bag right here. This is more adulty. It's got two handles on it. Look at it. Two handles. And it's really cute. <sighs> and it's tie-dye. And this is another one. With my mental health disorder, I tried thinking maybe I should donate two of them because today is Wednesday. I'm going to go to my local thrift shop and donate some stuff. So I did donate a couple old brassiers that don't fit. They're clean. Nothing wrong with them. They just don't fit me because I'm fat up here. But I did buy a new brassiers. Brazier. It's um no wire. It looks like a cut off tank top. It's called a um cami bra. A cami bra. Comments down below if you guys know what that is in your country because never heard of it here. It's comfortable. There's no padding. Um, I feel like I look flat chested even more. If I was like 150 pounds with my anorexia, and I definitely am. For me, I'm definitely pro Anna. If you don't like it, you don't have to watch me or follow me or whatever. That's just my opinion for my life. Look, I got the little Disney princesses on here. All my favorite old Disney ones. And this one that I'm pointing at right here, that's me. She's my favorite. Sleeping Beauty. She is my favorite. I even have the hairbrush of Sleeping Beauty. And I got the baby bottle, too. So, yep, this is another one. This one I probably could donate, but I do like it because it's got all the princesses on them and stuff. See? 
That's another bear, but that really don't fit me. That's really meant for a child. This is my little kitty cat with the ears on it. Got a, hit, a kitty cat. And it's like a pink fuzzy with sparkles. If you could see it up close. It's got sparkles. And it's the back of it. And if you look at the ears, the ears even got sparkles. Lots and lots of sparkles. So yeah, this is that one. That's a cute bag. My mommy got me this one. Oh my god, it's so cute. Um, this is shiny. I like, this kind of reminds me of a, a, a fidget cube. It makes scratchy noises and it's crumpling and crunchy and squishy. And it's got like blue and gold and pink sparkles. And it's, um, if you look, it's got a shiny material. And if you look real close, look, it's got hearts. Because I have a thing for hearts. My bedroom's all hearts. So it's got hearts on it and it's shiny and pretty. And this is a, definitely a, probably about for like a 12 year old, 13 year old girl for school. Probably 11, 12 year old, but it does fit me. And I usually bring this on adventures at caregivers or if I'm doing a video change. This isn't Little Space. This is more of my vintage 1950s purse. This is real leather. This is an original, ow, 1950s um, purse. It's original. It's my grandmother's. Hmm, it smells like that grandma look. It's old and new and opens up. And it's got the little chains where you put your chains back here. Long strap. This is worth a lot of money, but it's old and I like it. And here's the front of it. It's got the cute little bow in the front, which is very 50s and classy. I love it. I'm close again with the bow. And that's one of another one. This one I got at a local dollar store. And this is definitely pretty good. It's got ice cream on it or a cupcake. Super baby, super little and cute. I love this one. And this one I usually bring with me, but it just doesn't fit a lot of stuff. But it does cover my whole back. It's not tight. So this is definitely for an adult. It just has that cutesy little space vibe. Love it. And again, because I love Winnie the Pooh. This is definitely more for a child, but I could donate this, but should I donate them, guys, do you think? Because I don't really wear them. They don't really fit me. I can actually hold them up here more. But that's my Winnie the Pooh one. I think I might, to be nice, because, you know, it's cute, but they're only $4 or $5 a month I paid it when I was in the city. But look, Winnie the Pooh, super baby cute. And then my happy last one. My mom got me this one, too. It's got rainbows. Definitely little space, and it's got little cute stars on it up close. I love this one, and it's a lavender purple, which is my second favorite color next to pink. This is definitely for like 10 or, or 12 year old, but this definitely holds a lot more than the other ones. And I could actually, it's a book, but I could use it as a purse too, but yeah. So, I'm um, thinking about that, but yeah. Oh, oh yeah, and I got this one. I forgot my teddy bear. I got that at a Target. Um, or if another store is similar to Target is like a Walmart, but it's got the teddy bear and it's cute. It's got a little fluffy cotton ball. He's a bear and he's super baby cute. And look, cute, cute. And this is definitely for more child, but I got it and it just fits my straps. And if you look at the straps, they got sparkles on them. See them glitter, see them shimmer, see them sparkle with sprinkles. Hmm. So that's my other one. So yeah. So, I think I'm going to donate two of them. Be nice, because I'm a nice girl. Because they don't really fit. So, or maybe I shouldn't. What do you guys think? Should I donate these two? Because these are not really meant for my like back. I can't really use them. They're more just for cutesy, like, baby girl aesthetics. I don't know what to do. Donate them to maybe other people. I think I'm going to be a big girl and donate them. They're, not, they're only a year old. I got them in Manhattan for five bucks each, and I thought my little size like, oh my god, yes, I want it! And then I put it on my back because I'm an adult. It's like, oh shit, they don't fucking fit. <laughs> so I'm going to donate these two. There's nothing in them, so I'm not really worried about it. But like a big girl, you always got to check. Never know. I might have adult stuff in them. Like food and cookies and chips and lube or condoms or... Nope, she's empty, folks. Okay, so that's one donation. I'm such a nice little girl. Man, if I was seven again or ten, I'd be, a, and I, I had what I have now, empty again. I'd be, have a nice little friend. But 
kind of hard to play at a playground when you're an adult and you feel mentally like you're freaking 12 or 10 years old. But yep, empty again, empty again. But I'm going to donate you. It's all right. I'm going to donate you because, you know, it's the right thing to do. And some other little or middle might see it who's skinnier than me and can have it. So if you like this video, happy 28 subscribers. Thank you. Thumbs up button. It helps me out. Remember, if I don't get thumbs up, each subscriber should thumbs up my video. Because that's what you should do. It's a positive, happy vibe. I do that to people that I follow. Like, for example, Baby Blair. I love her videos. I follow her. She's awesome. Or my favorite that I would love to do an interview with, Diaper Perv. She's awesome. And I would love to do an interview. So if you're watching this, comments below, Diaper Perv. Let me be on your show. I would love to do an interview with you. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.